To use self-checkout in BookTracks, you will first need to access the module. For some workers, this will mean logging in to self-checkout as a user. Click the self-checkout button and log in with the credentials you are given by your BookTracks administrator. If you have a worker account for BookTracks and want to access self-checkout, click Circulation and choose Self-Checkout from the list. Now that we're in Self-Checkout, you can see that we are presented with a list of Patron Report classes. In most cases, this is usually the homeroom teacher. Depending on the settings for book tracks, instead of a Patron Report class list, you may be presented with a place to enter a Patron barcode or use the keypad to enter the Patron barcode. Now let's continue with using the Patron Report class list to access a Patron account. Select the appropriate Patron Report class and choose a student from the list. As you can see, the student name is displayed in the upper left-hand corner, along with any fines they may owe, and in the upper right-hand corner you're going to find their Patron number. At the bottom of the screen, you will see a list of any items they currently have checked out. Using the item barcode box, scan or type the barcode of an item you want to check out. The title of the item has been added to the list of the items on loan to the student. In this case, the setting to expect only one item at checkout has been enabled. The item barcode box has been removed and the system assumes you are ready to move to the next patron. If the setting to expect more than one item during self-checkout has been enabled, the item barcode box will remain on the screen. Either way, when you're ready to move to the next patron, click the Done button in the upper right hand corner and depending on the method you're using, you can either select the next student from the list or scan their patron barcode. Let's enter an item barcode and check it out to this student. As you can see, self-checkout is pretty straightforward. Locate the student and scan the item barcode of the item you want to check out. Now let's discuss self-check-in. And just like with self-check-out, you may be presented with a login screen. Click the self-check-in button and use your login credentials to access the module. If you have a worker account for BookTracks, you can access self-check-in by clicking circulation in the menu and click self-check-in. You see the self-check-in screen and your cursor is flashing in the item barcode box. Type or scan the item barcodes of the items you want to check in. The title of the item, the item barcode, and the patron name are all displayed at the bottom during the check-in process. This scanned item cannot be checked in because it was not checked out to a patron. Depending on the settings for self-checkout, in the lower right-hand corner you may see links for admin, view history, self-check-in or self-check-out, and log off. If the setting has not been enabled, you will not see these links. Let's click Admin to return to the administrative side of BookTracks.